Hey guys, it's Warren here and here's how to make a deliciously spicy butternut squash soup. I'll also stick a link at the end of the video on how to make the perfect white bread rolls that go brilliantly with this recipe. And this is enough for four portions of soup. To begin with, take one large onion, cut the ends off, peel and then slice in half. Then roughly chop and set aside. Now take two garlic cloves and again peel and roughly chop and set aside with the onion. Then take one red chilli, cut the end off and then slice into rings. Set aside with the onion and garlic, then take one butternut squash. Slice the end of the butternut squash off, then carefully, using a sharp knife, cut the squash in half just above the bulge at the bottom of the vegetable. Now cut the bottom end in half downwards to reveal the seeds, then use a spoon to hollow the seeds out from the squash. Use a vegetable peeler to peel the skin off, then chop all the butternut squash into one inch pieces, all of equal size. Also peel and chop one carrot, then take a large saucepan and place on the stove. Heat some olive oil up and then throw in the onion and garlic and red chilli. Fry for about five minutes over a medium to high heat while stirring continuously. Then add into the pan the butternut squash we chopped earlier along with the carrot. You now need to top the contents of the pan up with some boiling water until everything's just covered. Then crumble in one vegetable stock cube and season generously with some salt. Now give everything a stir and bring the pan up to boiling point. Then reduce the heat and leave to simmer for 15 minutes, topping the contents up with water if needed. And after 15 minutes, remove the pan from the heat and carefully separate the veg from the stock, leaving the stock aside for later. Now pour a small amount of the stock back into the vegetables and using either a regular or hand blender, blitz the veg until nice and smooth. Slowly keep adding small amounts of stock back into the pan whilst blending until you're happy with the consistency of the soup. And when you are happy with the thickness, stop blending and this soup can be served either straight away or reheated at a later date. And when serving, sprinkle with some freshly chopped parsley and if you want even more of a kick, sprinkle with some dried chilli flakes. And there you have it, that's how to make a deliciously spicy butternut squash soup. Now, if you loved the look of this soup recipe, remember to give this video a thumbs up. Remember also to subscribe and hit the bell button, which will notify you when I upload new videos. And you can check out more of my videos, including that bread roll recipe, by clicking on one of these appearing on screen.